Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is Cage848, and welcome back to Planet Terry's. Now, here's the thing, guys. The quest, my little tutorial quest thing, is telling me to put down a data beacon. Now, I think the data beacon is going to call in hordes. Uh, I don't think I'm ready for this, but I could be wrong, because if the game's telling me to do it right now, then maybe I am ready for it. Uh, before we do that, though, I'm going to look for a weapon upgrade because I can make myself an energy sword here. Uh, all right, so we need the psionics and the cr chrono stuff. Psionics and chrono stuff. Let's see if we have any. All right, there's the chrono stuff. Doesn't look like we have enough, so I'll take some of these out. All right, and the psy psionic stuff. What does that look like? I don't remember. So getting used to Yeah, we have plenty of that. Okay, cool. So let's go ahead and, and I don't know why I'm not putting all this stuff. Like basically you've got like these base materials and then they get refined into their like refined thing and they go from like basic to standard. Now I'm thinking, uh, part of me's thinking just refine it all. But then part of me's thinking, who knows? I might need the base stuff to craft some things. Uh, I don't have to refine it ahead of time. I could just refine it as needed and we'll just kind of, you know, take it from there. Uh, did I actually have enough? Uh, nope. I still need one. Okay, well, that shouldn't take too long. And I, what am I going to need for the the TD beacon? I'm, I think that's what it means. Yeah, Tata deck, uh, t tech data, Tata deck. Okay, okay, Gage. It's going to be one of those days, I say. Um, tech data beacon. Tech data beacon, okay. All right, so let's come on over here, and that should be just about done. I guess we could just go put this down now while I wait. I don't think the horde's going to come in, like, right away. So let's come on up here. Come on. Stupid useless jetpack. I wonder if I should just put it in the middle of this, uh... You know what? I probably could put it in the middle of that, that like, area, but... I, I don't think that's what the game means for me to do, so I won't be doing it. And who knows? Maybe you can't. Oh, this freaking thing. You die now! Thanks, bro. Thanks for the giblets. Oops, it's control. I was holding down shift. All right. Uh, can't put it here, right? Can't build here. It's too close. All right, that's fair. That's fair. I don't know where I want to put it, though. How far do I have to go? There we go. Um, see, the thing is, I can't take down these trees. So I think I'd want to have a nice open space to build this thing in. I... I don't really know how this is going to work, but I think it's going to be like, um, I'm going to have to build a defensive base around it or something. So I'm going to want to build it out in a somewhat open area. Um, one of the problems with this game is you can't take down these big trees as far as I know. Maybe there's like some tech I get later that I can take down the big trees, but I can't right now. Um, so I'm going to assume I never can. All right? And then that's going to make it harder to build like a base around this thing. Um, can I put it right here? Does not look like it. Uh, what do I do? Lower mouse wheel and shift. Yeah, I don't know. Um, mouse wheel plus shift. Okay, I'm doing that. Not doing anything. I'm trying to, like, raise it and lower it. Uh, what is that saying? Okay, data collect. Yep, okay. I mean... I don't know how far I want to make it. Alright, let me find a place for this. I'm assuming it'll show up on the map, so I'll be able to find it easy when I do when I do finally place it down. This will probably be okay. I don't know, whatever. All right, cool. Prepare and when you're uh, prepare and when ready, complete any data collection from your beacon. Oh, oh, okay. Um, basic alien data collect amount two collection collection. Process time five, collection cost 500. Uh, this beacon can collect tech data. Initiali initializing the data collection process will attract unwanted attention and hostilities to this location. Make sure you're prepared uh, to protect the beacon before starting the data collection. Okay, cool. Went ahead and gathered a bunch of resources and I was thinking about making an auto turret, but then I'm thinking, now nah, let's just try and do one of these by ourselves and see how, see how it goes. <laughs> And uh, where, there it is. There it is. So I'm going to pick it up and put it back down um, because I want to put it on a platform. All right. So destroy. 
There we go. And let's go ahead and put down some platforms. And I don't know if... Like, I don't know how any of the defense works in this game. So we're just going to kind of have to... You know, we're going to make a 3x3 three three here. And then just kind of defend it as best we can. It's annoying that the um, trees are inside of it, but that's okay. Not a huge deal. It's not like my main base. It's only like a like a horde base. So, nope. Oh, looks like we're getting thirsty. All right, we're also getting hungry. I'm going to have to go back and get some food, too. I didn't realize how low I was on stuff. Uh, actually, hold on. I think I can craft these on the go. Yes, I can. All right, let's just craft a bunch of those. All right, now we don't have to go back. Let's go ahead and put down the beacon again. Oh, don't tell me you can't put this on here. Seriously? What the fudge? Okay. Then what we're going to do is we are going to destroy and then try and put it in the middle. I don't know. Seems pretty good to me. All right. I don't know how this is going to go. What I'm going to do is just in case it goes horribly, horribly wrong, we're going to go ahead and save the game. All right, and then I'm just gonna. Oh yeah, by the way, I made my new sword. It looks exactly like the old sword. I think it would have been cool if these if these energy swords like were colors based on you know their quality. So like the regular one should have been. Get the fudge out of here! What's your problem, bro? Douchebag. Um, yeah, it would have been cooler if like they were based on like the first one should have been regular, the second one should have been green, then blue, then red, and that could signify the uh, you know. Some Jedi stuff or whatever. All right, let's go ahead and start the initial collection. It's going to cost us 500 of this. And I really don't even know what this is for. Um, I don't see a timer, so I'm not sure when it's done. But I don't know how bad the horde is going to be. Uh, running from your beacon. Oh, man, they're all pissed. Wait, why is that guy not taking any damage? Wait, what the heck? What? They're not taking any damage. Okay, hold on. Yeah, what the hell? Oh, oh, they're starting to take some damage now. Is it something with me being up here? Yeah, this isn't going to work. Yeah, look at this. Look at this. Oh, oh, I, I see. It might be if you hit him from... Yep. Okay. Yeah, this isn't going to work. All right, you guys. Hooah! Yeah, there's no way I could defeat this. No chance. No chance. That's what you got. Okay, I think it's time for a reload. Well, that was an absolute S show. So I think what we're going to do now is we are going to grab all the food and drink we have. And we're going to head back to the cave. Okay, I wish I could mark stuff on the map. I don't see any way to do that. Um, but yeah, we're going to head back to that cave and we're going to grab a bunch more stuff. Um, I'm going to need a lot of firepower to face that horde. That was, I wasn't even close. Wasn't even close to be able to handle that. So I do have these energy turrets and I'm going to want to make, I'm going to want to make four of these, which means I'm going to need eight construction kits, which means I'm going to need standard construction kits, which means gravo, whatever, gravitor metal is um not that big of a deal, but this stuff, I mean, 16 of that and 16 of that. And the best place I know to get it is at the caves. So let's see how long it takes for us to get over there with the jetpack. Because I'm kind of curious. Um, as far as I can tell, there's no fall damage. I have not taken fall damage yet. The jetpack doesn't last that long, but it also uh, recharges pretty quickly. So um, let's make sure we're facing the right direction. I can't tell. Yeah, we are. All right. So we're going to go this way. We're going to go over there. We're going to see what we can do. I, I think those energy turrets are probably going to need power of some kind. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to try the horde again today. It depends. I'm not really sure. It's kind of weird that this tutorial is telling me to do the horde when, like, there's no way. There, unless I'm missing something obvious. Very well could be the case. Wouldn't be the first time. Won't be the last. But I don't think I am. I think this is a, a, is a crazy horde we're going to have to get through. And the tutorial did not take me through the steps that I would need to be able to survive it. What the heck? I couldn't move. I was like, did I hurt myself? I don't think so, though. All right, so this is looking good, and got to go this way. Oh, the big open field. I love the open fields. Let's come through here. The open fields, especially go through the open fields at night. That's how you're going to find most of the resources. 
It, it might even be better than the cave, honestly. Um, but I'm gonna go to the cave anyway, because it's all concentrated and everything. Uh, I will have to fight some enemies in the cave. They're pretty weak, but together they could be a problem. And I don't know if, like, certain materials are in that cave, and I'm gonna have to take a look. I need the psionic stuff and the, um... I don't remember what the other stuff was. I, I could always go back and watch it. Uh, but yeah, I need the psionic stuff and something else. When I get to something else, I'll, I'll remember the name of it. You guys probably tell me in the comments, but I can't see your comments yet because uh, the video's not up yet in the time of me recording it. All right, are we looking good? Yeah, let's go this way. And I will be looking around for any materials. It's a little bit harder to spot them during the day, but you can still do it. Just bounce off that tree. <laughs> no big deal. Yep, see, I saw this yellow stuff over here. I gotta start remembering what's what. Uh, okay, it's not that stuff. That's not the stuff I need. I know it's psionics and something else. All right. And, oh, there's some orange rocks over here. Orange crystals. I'm gonna call them crystals. They kind of look like crystals. What do you got for me? So, as far as that um, neuthrium, I don't think that was it. Pretty sure it wasn't i'm pretty sure it wasn't either of these all right so here's the deal with that with that horde um i was shooting those enemies now it was barely doing any damage i got a stutter there it was barely doing any damage and i was i was thinking about it i was like why would that barely do any damage now there's two possibilities for that not barely doing any damage number one i was shooting from above and those things have like it looks like they have like armor from above so maybe you got to shoot them from below very well could be the case the other thing I was thinking might be the case is uh, maybe, like, I remember one of the, I read it somewhere, I don't remember where, I read somewhere that enemies, like, some enemies are really, like, uh, Sonic's nice, so that's uh, turquoise or light blue. Anyway, some some of the enemies will not get hurt much by, uh, fire, by projectiles, and that might be one of those, you know, enemies. So, I, I don't know which one was the case, but it's one of those two. All right, let's see if we get in here. So I've got the psionics, but not the other stuff. All right, so this is psi psionics. Very good. All right, and what is this? I might have to look up what the other thing is I need. I don't remember. Maybe it was the Neuthrum. So I went ahead and looked it up, and the other stuff was Geolux. And I got to be honest, I think I've only ever seen that from killing enemies. So, we might have to kill some enemies, and luckily for me, there's some enemies down here. I hope they drop the stuff I need, because I'm going to need about 16 of it, and, uh, yeah. Uh, is it one for one in the, uh... I think it's two for one, so I'm going to need 32 of it. I mean, I might already have some at home. I'm going to walk out of here a lot. Like, that's it. That's what it's all about. I don't know how much I need, but I'm just going to get more. I don't think inventory will be an issue. My, he my hit points might be an issue. If I lose a lot of hit points down here, I'll have to wait for them to come back, which is kind of annoying. But it is what it is. I don't even know what I need this new room stuff for. Alright. Here we go. Nothing's coming up? Okay. Now there will be there's like these guys in here, in case you didn't watch last episode, there's guys in here and like they're 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 not they're not tough on their own, but like they get when they get together, there's a few of them and it and it becomes a problem. I don't want to just come in here and shoot them. Okay. Do I ever have to reload this thing or? Oh, you don't have to reload it, but it can cool that it can um, heat up like overheat. Let's give that thing a break. Yeah, see, there's so many of them. And they're not dropping what I need, either. Oh, they're really not dropping what I need. Okay, we might have to go kill some of the things outside. If they're just going to be right on top of me, I might as well just use my sword. Yep, they're not dropping what I need at all. That's gonna be a problem. I don't think there's a lot of them. 
What is this? Oh, okay. I guess I'm just gonna go in there with my sword and hope for the best and plan for the worst. There we go. I think there's a lot of them in here. Oh, what is that? A chest? Wow. Healing and energy wall core. Oh, how do I... Can I put that on? There we go. Now I got an energy core. Or an energy wall core. Curious what's down here. Oh, nice. Cooked prism firm and galactic credits. Cool. My first galactic credits. Oh shit! Did you see them all? Tell me you saw them all, because I'm not going back. <laughs> Holy crap! I'm hoping I can run them off. Alright, the hell with it. Shit, I'm gonna die. Yep, let's get the hell out of here. Oh, maybe we could just kind of kite him along. That's a lot of them. I just don't want to get, like, stuck, you know? Maybe I can kill them all if I just kite them. I'm just worried that they're respawning, you know? Because if they're respawning, this ain't gonna do, any, do me any good. We got a little bit of armor. Okay. They're all done. Health isn't looking too great. Uh, we are getting some more sound. I gotta I gotta get a bunch of the, the psionic stuff. And then I gotta figure out exactly what I gotta kill for the other stuff. Cause I'm pretty I think I could just kill like stuff around my base, which would be good. Maybe I could put up one turret at my base. And use it to kill stuff, and I could kind of test it out to see how good they are. Actually, you know what? That's a really good idea. I'm gonna do that. Yeah, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set up one of the turrets around my base. That way, I don't have to wait so long to make them because I want to make four at a time for my horde base. But I could make just one for my regular base and just kind of test out and see how they work. And I could also use that to kill the enemies around my base, so I can um, uh, so I can hopefully loot some of that other stuff that I need. That geo. Geo stuff. All right. I guess I'll start off with the gun. How much ammo do I have left? Uh, none. Not seeing any ammo. Yep, I don't have any. Okay, that's fine. The ammo is actually pretty cheap. It's actually cheaper than the arrows for the bow. All right, come down here. And we got a f one more. Wow, okay. Is that it? Dude, I did not think I was gonna be able to do that. That makes me very happy. Like when you don't think you could do something and you get it done and not get, oh man. Okay, hold on. Let's loot this. Water and... Ooh, construction kit. I need those. Alright, let's see if we can finish these guys. Alright, and level 6. We are getting some lag down here. Which is uh, kind of sucky, but what are you going to do? Early access, right? Oh, by the way, this is going up on the 15th. You guys should be able to be playing this by today. Let me know if you're playing it. Uh, 
Should I just loot the things and get the hell out of here? It feels like they're respawning. What the fuck? No. No, no, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, thank you. I'll probably go check it out, but I'm gonna loot first and save. Okay. If I had more, um, range weapons, I could probably fight from up here, honestly. What is this? What is this? Oh, okay. Might as well get it. And then we're gonna do is we're gonna save, we're gonna go f I think that's a boss, by the way. So I'm gonna go ahead and save the game, and then we're gonna go fight the boss. Hopefully the lag goes away. Alright, I think this is gonna go very poorly, and the lag is not helping either. And the lag is not going away. Um, this could be a problem. I don't think I'm gonna be able to fight like this. But I'm just kinda curious what's up here. Pretty sure it's a boss of some kind. With like another 50 guys. Yep, here we go. Oh my goodness. I can't tell what the heck is going on. I don't even know if I'm hurting them. Yeah, I think I am. It looks like I'm hurting them. Oh, now they're hurting me. I don't like that. And down I go. Yep. Ain't no way that was going to work out. Okay, I'm kind of screwed here. Um, I was under the impression that if I saved, I could reload after death. Um, I would not have attacked that boss with 10 frames per second. <laughs> and pretty much knew I was going to die. But I figured if I saved first, I'd be okay. But apparently, yep. And we got these guys. I don't know if I'm able to get, I don't know if I'm able to get my body back. I, I might have lost everything. Which is going to be um, kind of soul crushing, I'm not going to lie. Game's a little grindy. Uh, you know, but we'll see. We'll see. Oh, come on. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Actually, without my um, jetpack, I don't think I'm... No, I died right on the boss. There's no way I'm going to be able to get my body back. I forgot about that. Okay, well. We're going to give it the old college try. See what we can do here. All right. Jump past you. Jump past you. Jump past... Jump over you. Oh, hold on. Oh, oh, excuse me. Oh, there's the boss. Okay. There's no way this is going to happen. I'm going to walk up that that area. And I'm going to... Can I... Can I just maybe stay here for a second? Okay. All right. Maybe. Maybe. So my body's up that way. And we just kind of... Yeah, I don't need you guys coming over here. Nope. Not over there, please. Maybe I should go over there. I'm going to wait for myself to get some hit points back. When I walk up there, they're going to they're gonna follow me. I'm going to get trapped. And that's where my body is, if it's there. I don't even know if it's there. So, I'm just going to kind of see what's what. Let's go this way. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to climb up these things. Hopefully, I can climb up these things. And then keep them on this side. And then eventually, when I get full hit points, I'll make a run for it. And we'll just kind of see what's what. <laughs> There's no way this is going to work. <laughs> I think I'm screwed. So you guys need to let me know in the comments if I can't get my body back. Are you willing to hang out with me through the grind? Because I lost a lot of stuff. Like, a, I lost my jetpack, all my weapons, everything. So let me know in the comments. Uh, because I'll be happy to make more videos if people will watch. But um, I don't know if this is going to work. We're just going to wait for all these guys to come over here. And I'm kind of surprised I got in here. To be honest. Now you guys come over here. I want him as far away from that. Now I gotta run down that cave, get my body, and get out. <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna happen. Um, okay. All right, I'm gonna wait for a hundred hit points. And eh, 99 is good enough. Let's go. And here we go. Here we go. Oh, uh, they are right behind me, aren't they? I don't even know if my body's gonna be up here, to be honest. Okay. Uh, it doesn't look like it. This isn't where I came in, is it? I don't think this is where I came in. No, this isn't where I came in. Is this where I fought the boss or not? I don't know. I don't know where this is. Where the heck am I? Okay, maybe that wasn't where I fought the boss. Okay, so this is back to the entrance. 
That might not have been where I fought the boss. Let's see what we can find over here. So this is gonna... Am I going back? I can't tell. I think I might be. I'm lost. Completely lost. I don't know if I'm heading back to the open room or back to the entrance. Open room. Okay, here's the open room. Alright. Excuse me. I thought that was where the boss was. Maybe it was. It's gotta be. I don't see any other caves. Yeah, so my body my body's not up there. Unless it was that one. Okay. Excuse me. No. There's not one. It must have been the other. It must have been that one. Yeah, my body wasn't there. Unless I'm missing it. I'm pretty sure this is where I fought the boss and lost. And my body should be right here. And I don't see it. Ah. All right, guys, let me know in the comments because I need to know if I should continue this series or not. Um, this is, you know, <laughs> it's a pretty grindy game, but you know what? It's early access, so, you know, you expect things like this to happen, but yeah. So let me know in the comments. All right. Uh, spawn at your bed. Bed zero. Bed. All right, cool. Well, not cool, but, you know, it is what it is. All right, guys, I'm going to call this one here. Let me know in the comments what you think. Uh, if you had... If you ended up enjoying the video, man, I'm freaking shook, man. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.